mean, I was at one of my daughter's uh, sports days recently and uh, kind of watching this tribe of young girls run past me. I couldn't see who won. So I turned to the teacher next to me and I said, who, who won the race? And the teacher looked at me like I'd crawled out from under an, you know, a rock and she said, what? She said, nobody won. That's not the point. You know, I was flabbergasted. I thought that was the point of a race. But she said, look, and everybody was getting a medal. Now, that's the way school is these days. We ask our young people's opinions until they come and work in our offices. And then the CEO doesn't stand at the lift uh, on a Monday morning welcoming them back from the weekend and thanking them for being there. And they don't get a medal every Friday for surviving the week. And nobody needs their opinions. Nobody needs their help. And these young people are our future. They're our employees and customers of today, the youngest of our employees and customers of today. But their attitudes and values are going to shape our world. I don't think we should bend over backwards to accommodate them. I don't think they need certificates every Friday. But I do think we have to understand they have hugely different expectations of the world of work. And we've got to meet them part way in order to get the best out of them.